The final session for vetting cabinet secretary nominees kicked off with MPs hearing from former director of public prosecutions Kiriako Tobiko, now nominated to head the environment ministry. Integrity accusations that bedeviled the DPP mainly featured in the vetting allegations Kiriako dismissed as baseless. MPs sought to know the achievements the outgoing DPP had made in his previous docket that warranted a promotion to the cabinet. Tobiko bragged of improving conviction rates in violent crimes from 48% to 75%, as well as decentralization of the Office of Public Prosecution. Cabinet nominee for Water and Sanitation Simon Chelugui countered an affidavit filed by Ann Wado, the proprietor of St. Elizabeth Academy Karen, accusing him of breaching a contract to drill water in the private school. Chelugui, who has vast experience in water matters, promised that should the committee approve his name and President Uhuru appoint him, he will ensure availability of water in cities and towns. What will be our Mishuki moment? At least three things that you intend to achieve in your first 100 days in office. If approved, Mr. Chairman, I will immediately engage uh, counties, uh, both uh, collectively and bilaterally, I will work very, very, very closely with the Council of uh, Governors. The public should know uh, what these allegations were, if you are aware of them, and uh, what is your response. In the end, the lady, uh, uh, the CEO, Anne Wadu, paid us only for the agreed uh, contracted sum of 250 meters, which was coming to, at that time, around 2.4 million because it was deeper. We have uh, counties that produces water and supplies water in Kenya. In your own opinion, do you think those counties should be compensated? And how do you plan to deal? Because water mainly is dealt with by the county government. How do you plan to deal with many water companies that we have supplying water to the residents and most of them exploiting the residents? How do you deal, plan to work with the county government to make sure that Kenyans have access to water and water is also affordable uh, water resource will be an issue a big issue because we deal with the sourcing protection of our catchment and also sharing of this resource it is true that some parts of this country are suffering inadequacy and some parts of this country have relative plenty so water resources is a critical issue we have always been suggesting that this cash transfer be transferred using mobile money transfer because we are in a digital world. It has not been implemented. But I'm happy uh, to report that the Ministry has already taken note of this and is being addressed. The now cash transfers will be uh, done through MPSA. A monitoring system is also put in place and uh, as a policy that nobody should travel more than 20 to 30 kilometers to look for this money. Former Marasabit Governor Ukori Tan, nominated to head the Labor Ministry, was put to task on how he would reform NSSF as well as measures he would employ to deal with industrial strikes. Cabinet nominee for sports Rashida Chesa promised to set up sports academies in each and every county if approved. His promise coming even as he was put to task to explain an affidavit from a woman was challenging his nomination, citing integrity issues. The Committee on Appointments now retreats to prepare a report on the nominees that will be tabled in Parliament in two weeks. Kevin Washira, Chanoa News.